I love glitter. It adds the perfect touch to my craft projects. Doesn't glitter make everything better? Except... To create a negative glittered image, you can use any shaped punch. You can even use a standard round hole punch. It makes great glittered polka dots. Cover the back of your hole with clear tape. Here I'm using wide packing tape. Sprinkle the glitter onto the sticky side of the tape. Patting down the glitter firmly will make sure you get good coverage. Using a piece of clean paper keeps the glitter on your project and not on your hands. Now let's make a sparkly background for a positive shape. Use a plastic bag or waxed paper to keep your tape from sticking to your work surface. I'm using the positive shape left from my snowflake punch as my focal point. You can also use a die cut or a shaped sticker. Pressing firmly on the back side of the tape will also help make that glitter stick. Brush off any loose particles with a paintbrush. Now you have a very glittery background. Using transparent glitter will allow an image to shine through your window. Use vibrant colors for your inks as the glitter will diffuse your image. This border looks great for the edges of cards or scrapbook pages. You can make the border as long as you want. Since the plastic is slippery, I'm using a few pieces of tape to hold my edges temporarily. Now this long strip of tape is for the glitter. Remove the temporary holding tape, but leave the long strip in place. Now that I've shown you some glitter and tape techniques, let's get fabulously glittery! Content. 
Wait. Wait, do I have something on me? Where? 